everyone. In this video, we're going to code a basic model in NetLogo Web. This model is quite simple. A butterfly flies around on the background. Let's go make it. First, let's Google NetLogo Web. Then you'll go to the website. You will see two icons on the page. One is a NetLogo, is computer-based. The other is NetLogo Web. Let's go there. NetLogo Web will load a random model for you. You can choose more, or you can load your own model. But this time, we're going to build a new model here. Let's click on New. Now we have a blank model. You can see there is a mode set interactive. And also, you can see there is an export as a net logo or a web page mode. So let's first switch from interactive to authoring. Once you are in the authoring mode, you can see you can drag the window to expand or narrow the entire functional area. You can also add different functional parts of a model. Let's add a button first. We will put in command set up. Then we click OK. Once you create the button, you can see you can resize it and also you can move it around to put wherever you want to put it. Then I'm going to create a go button. Create a button and then put command go. At this time, the text on both buttons are red because there's no code associated with them. Let's scroll down to put down some code. You can put code into the command center, but you can only put a very short and just work once. Let's put code into the NetLogo code window. Leave a few lines empty because you might need to add variables in the future. Type to set up and end. We'll put code between to and end. We first place clear all to make sure to clear everything happened last time so that the setup will reset the model. Then we put setup turtles and then setup patches. The last line reset the NetLogo internal clock. Then click on the recompile code to connect the code to the button. Now it says there's no command called set up turtles. Yeah, we have not put that yet. Let's write that code. Put down to setup and end. And then we'll fill in the command in the middle. We put down create-turtles1. Then we will set up two set up patches. Patches are the background of the model. We will ask patches bracket set p color 54. p color means patches color. 54 is a green color. Recompile. Let's go to the interactive mode. Now the text is black. Click on that. We have a turtle on the green background. This little turtle is a bit boring. Let's make it more interesting. Go to the two setup 
turtles. Add a bracket below create turtles one. We're going to set up the size, shape, and color of the turtle. We will use the set command. Set size, set shape, and set color. We will set size as two. Set shape as butterfly. Make sure you have the quotation mark. Then we set the color fifty eight. Recompile the code. Now you have a butterfly. Let's make the butterfly move around. In the code window, put down to go and, and between the lines, let's put in the command move. Move is not a preset command in NetLogo. We need to create the actual code of move to make butterfly moving around. How do we want the butterfly to move? Randomly. How can we have a randomly moved butterfly? We can break down random movement into two steps. Randomly choose a direction, move forward a bit, and then repeat that. Random choose a direction, move forward a bit. We can use command random to generate a random number. Here. We have random three sixty. Why three sixty? Yes, it's a degree. Random three sixty means randomly choose a number from zero to three fifty nine. Then we add right in front of random to make turtle make right turn. So this put turtle right turn. A random degree, and then we ask turtle to move forward one step. You can break down the command line to make it shorter, but oops, make sure you break it at the right place. Now let's go back to take a look. Make sure you recompile. Keep clicking the go button. You can make the butterfly move around. Can we let the butterfly move around by itself? Yes. Switch to authoring mode. Click on Go to add it. Check the Forever button. Then back to interactive mode. Now click on Go. Butterfly keep moving around. Congratulations! You just create. A basic model in NetLogo Web. Let's make sure we save it. Click on Export NetLogo. The pop-up window will allow you to save the model. It will be downloaded to your downloading folder by default. In the future, you can use the button Choose File. To upload this model into NetLogo Web, to play it, run it, or keep working on that. Thanks for watching. Happy coding!